Hey folks, Mad Rabbit here. Back to you in Medieval Minecraft. Um, today just wanted to come back to you and kind of show you what I've been working on since last episode. Um, today I'm trying to use a new microphone. You may have heard me mention it in that uh, channel update rant um, from uh, a short while back. <laughs> a few days ago actually. So it's kind of... Um, hopefully it all works out right. I, I'm having a lot of problems with it, so I'll go into that maybe in a little bit. Um, mainly because I have tons of footage here and I kind of jammed it all down as you can see here this area is a kind of a new area um, I just felt like getting away from the city I was working on and kind of develop a new area I had some ideas on how to make things go quickly so this is kind of a before picture I kind of had done the, the roadway several months ago here um, this is the area where there's like an, an elf city and this wall was also done about a couple months ago but this is not the area we're working on, but um, the roadway is going to lead up to it. So this is where the main high elf city is going to be, Esper City itself. Um, what I end up doing, I go back there to the beginning. Um, it was actually a, a pretty, there's two mountains that kind of meet almost, and there's like a pass in between. And I'm going to build this huge wall in between, as you can see here. It worked out pretty quickly. <laughs> Because I was using MC Edit, and I had actually shot some footage of MC Edit, but um, I decided not to use it. Uh, it was going to be too difficult to splice it all into this, and this was already going to be a very long. I kind of did not want this to go two or three episodes. I just wanted to do it all in one episode to kind of show all of it. And um, I guess you could sort of use some of this as a tutorial, but I really didn't show every solitary thing, so it's. It's a little bit confusing, but as you can see here, um, work actually was pretty quick for me to get done, even though I, I worked several hours today on this. Um, mainly using the editor was very helpful in getting this done quicker. Um, yeah, I'm just, um, I guess I'll just let the footage speak for itself and uh, just talk about other things. I don't really, um, don't really know. Or just commentating over this would be really useful, but um, yeah, I, I as I as I mentioned in the channel update video, um, I've been trying to put some extra time and effort into the videos. Um, kind of, you know, I bought this piece of equipment, this new microphone, which is a hundred dollars, and for me, like I said before, I'm unemployed. It's kind of expensive for me, um, so hopefully. It all works out. I'm having a lot of problems with getting it to work, though. So, well, I don't. I really don't know what to what to do about. It. I contacted the company, and I think I've got to got it working now. But I don't know what the volume levels. They're they're going to be a little bit off for a while. And um, I had to use a different connector. I think that may have been the problem, but. <laughs> Uh, it's a whole thing. It's just oh, so aggravating for the past couple of days now dealing with this, but I got so much footage of Skyrim clogging up my my hard drive. I'm, li I'm literally like a week and a half ahead of episodes if I upload one a day. So I figured I was going to shoot some Minecraft stuff today and I sucked up basically the rest of my hard drive with this stuff. So I had to get some I had to get some of this stuff off of there. And I'm probably going to upload this then a day after I, I'm actually shooting this uh, the commentary here. It's just it's taking for, forever to, to render all these things. I, I, mainly because I'm just spending a lot of time playing the game. And I, I accumulate all this footage and then I'll you know, go in there and play and then do the, uh, the editing. And it'll take me like a whole week to catch up to just a few hours worth of uh, gameplay I'm doing on the weekend or something, you know. So... It's, um, I'm getting too far ahead, basically. So I just create a lot of work for myself with uh, a lot of editing, and, and those are taking a lot longer to edit. So this show here, uh, I've been wanting to come back to it for a while, but obviously it's just, um, hasn't been a lot of viewership on the Skyrim ones, and it hasn't been a lot of viewership on this show, which is sort of like, you know, the show I, I kind of kind of built my channel on. So I've been kind of upset with that. The viewership kind of dropped off, so that's mainly what most of your, what, what you've been missing in some of these channel update videos. Mainly just me complaining a lot about that, and um, I had said I was going to, 
apply to one of the networks, which basically I was applying to TGN. They had actually sent me some solicitations in the past um, to join their network. And then when I had kind of deleted the emails, like I may have mentioned in a couple, well, I mentioned recently in a couple different videos, <clears throat> that um, I'm basically, um, I, I sort of regret it now. But I think maybe I could have streamlined the process to get in. But the thing is, I applied to kind of like on my own, and they rejected my basically saying I, I, I don't have enough of view, enough views, and that's true because lately, even though I have a lot of old videos, I have a lot of views. Lately, just no one's been watching, and that's been disappointing to me, frustrating to me, which is why I've gone through all this stuff trying to get new equipment um, and all that stuff. So. Yeah, even spending money, I'm, I'm just not making money on these things. Um, that last video in this series, I had put some music to. I can't even prove the you. It's just the whole thing on the monetization thing too. That's been very, very frustrating. Trying to prove to YouTube that um, that you own your own music, you own your own footage, that the the owners of the games allow you to um, to actually use their game footage and some companies do some companies don't and it's a whole thing with that so I won't go into all that because if just watch that video where I'm complaining a lot <laughs> and um, and talking about the monetization process trying to get basically putting ads on the ads on the videos to maybe make a little bit of money I know I know I'm not gonna make real money I think I made a whole whopping six cents so far so <laughs> it's after doing this for uh, what was that been about a week or week and a half so let's see on this rate maybe I'll, I'll be able to get a payment um, ooh, probably in about a decade of maybe a few dollars but <laughs> yeah so it's just not we're not really um, not really gonna work out too well as far as that goes but eh, well, what are you gonna do I'm not gonna complain about that too much I'm um, hoping to, um, like I said before, trying to implement um, more changes, more, 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 just you know, kind of expanding my horizons as far as editing goes, and uh, changing how I edit some of the videos, putting more time into it. This here, I, I even this it was a lot of editing, but it was. Um, I still feel like a cob job to me. It's just like I, I had so much footage, I just had to get it off of there, so I just sort of did a partial edit. And I would have liked to have um, gone through some of this footage and probably uh, or maybe just not even have had a lot of this and maybe make the video a lot shorter. But I think people want to see this from this series. They want to see actually how I build an entire area in one episode. I think this is good because like it was sort of like the last episode where we I, I basically just took an area and said I'm gonna build here develop it and see what I can do and so now I'm doing that with this area and it's a pretty big area too I mean it's, it's there's a whole there's gonna be a whole kingdom here there's gonna be some a, a town and a city and well, actually a few cities in the, in the kingdom area Kind of based off this the same architectural kind of white look, and you'll see a lot of the the custom textures I made too from the texture pack. Um, but mostly it's still mostly Doku craft the texture pack. So, oh, and I did want to talk about um, the additions for one the next Minecraft update, which is 1.7, I think it is. Some really great stuff coming, and I've been waiting for stuff like this, but it's not, we're not quite there yet. You know how I complained a couple episodes ago about hoping that they'll have more like a creative update? They're, they're adding a lot of new blocks and a lot of neat, interesting stuff to the game, particularly new biomes. Um, that was, I was waiting for that. I was really hoping that they were going to do that. I think they should actually add more than what they even added. They added like a ton of new biomes, probably like. I forgot the number, but I remember like there was, it had to have been like maybe about 20. Although some of them were just the same biome, but like, like, um, plateaued versions or hilled versions of the same one, but 
it, it looks really good. I've been I've, I've seen a couple of preview videos from other channels and really good stuff. And they're, they're they improved the fishing. They um, they just they a lot more flowers for you can get dyes easier. Because that was one of my complaints is like it's hard to get lapis. So if you were to legitimately build and trying to get lapis, um, that's a pain. So with all these new flowers are a lot more dyes, and they also have some of these environments actually have some new blocks, um, some new clay blocks. I know that in the last update they had some clay, colored clay, but now they have some other color, type of colored clay or something. It's just a, it's a whole thing. And they change the way oceans are. And I got a feeling they're doing this to prepare us for more animal mobs, kind of like what we did with the horses, because you got to get the... You gotta get the biome set up before you start putting the, the, the new animals in. I'm hoping they're gonna do that. I'm pretty sure they're gonna. I think you're gonna see a lot more things from like the mole creature stuff, and I I was really hoping that they would put that stuff in there. And it looks like this update is gonna be like a, a prelude to that. And since this is only the first snapshot that I took a look at, I, th I think we're gonna, they may, you might see even more stuff, more interesting things coming. Um. So the way that some of the trees are rendered in some of the environments are different too. Um, the new biomes, I just say. So it, it looks really good. I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to the next release already. And I was a little bit nervous too, because it took so long for them to, for, since 1.6 was released, to actually put this out. But there really was quite a bit that they put in. So I'm, I'm cautiously optimistic. It's all set. That's my term of the day. Um, hopefully this is all picking up correctly because it looks like it is. It sort of is. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm sort of. Uh, I guess I should actually talk about what we're doing here. Hmm? Basically, the wall is finished, as you can see. Uh, making some towers and things to scatter along the landscape. These first couple attempts at. Um, yeah, lamps didn't clearly work out. This one a little better. Then I make a bigger one, and I'm going to start scattering those around the environment. Um, but yeah, using the editor, it's just, it's just a, a lifesaver. Because if I had to make these, like, duplicate them myself over again, oh, I don't know if I would even attempt to do any of this kind of stuff. Because now, you can see here, I'm going to work on a new a new system of walls that are kind of surrounding the roadway as you're going up and then I'm also going to have like a sort of like a city kind of halfway between that major city with the wall that was kind of circular that you saw at the beginning so there's a whole lot of work to be done but I'm, most likely it'll be pretty easy work because it'll be like maybe I work on maybe do like you know a bunch of smaller buildings but I won't really need to make a whole lot of smaller buildings just a few, scatter them around in each one of these cities, make some walls. And it really won't take that long to get this uh, this particular kingdom finished, uh, I don't think. Then I can go back to one of the other cities or towns and work on them. What kind of, uh, I don't know, this kind of, this, this tower here. Um, it's kind of like what you'll see here, I build, I build a wall off of it and I'm just kind of making it all modular. So when I copy and paste them all in, the wall segments and the these towers, uh, they'll kind of all fit in. But you'll see how I do it in, in a minute here, building it up. But yeah, so I'm, I'm just um, pretty frustrated with things, and as you could probably tell from the past couple of update videos, and um, I put a ton of effort in those Skyrim videos. And just about, like, I'm getting less than 10 views per video. The first episode got maybe, I think it's some. But, okay, here's a nice, here's some of the last panoramic shots that, uh, I'll take you through real quickly. But, um, yeah, I really would encourage people to want to hopefully go and watch some of my Skyrim stuff, too. I know maybe if you're just not into it, okay, but, you know, I'm, I'm just trying to, uh, put a lot of effort into though that series and even the first episode was quite a bit different than the rest of the episodes so don't base um, your judgment only on upon the first episode but I did put a lot of effort into them and I'm hoping to um, keep going with it probably pretty consistently until I get um, 
until I get basically get to a point where I feel like I'm going to end the season again. I'm going to probably upload five days a week just because I have such a backlog of, of episodes and footage. But yeah, this is basically it, guys. Um, I'm going to come back. I'm going to do more on this. Um, I kind of only took that wall halfway to that other city. So I'm going to be doing a town next, like sort of in between, maybe a city or town. Some other towers and, and walls around that little area. And then, so that will, might be in the next episode, but I really don't know what's gonna, where we're going to work on next. There's going to be in some other buildings here in front too, and around this wall. But um, yeah, I guess that's really about it. See you next time. Adios, folks.